All right, guys. So today's video, we have an old iPad that, as you can see, is at ninety percent. But if I unplug it. log into it you can see it's at 90% give it a few minutes and this thing like shuts off on you when it gets to I want to say um, like 80% or something like that which I've never seen that happen before the we can't do a software update because it has too much data on it and there's not enough room to install the update. So what I'm gonna try is I'm going to try to erase this thing and set it back to factory defaults and see if, what the hell, yeah, see? It's dead again. Can't do nothing. All right. Let's see it spinning because it's shutting off. And now, if I plug it back in, you see the battery. So this thing is completely useless like this. So we're gonna try to set it back to factory defaults and see if that helps the battery situation. All right, guys. All right, guys. So I just erased this iPad. I restarted it. I did the updates, the software update. And it's at 88%. And it's still on. It's not shutting off like it did before. That was crazy. I've never seen an iPad do that before. But yeah, so again, so what you want to do is if your iPad is shutting down, even though you have a full charge, you want to try erasing the data and restoring it to back to the factory defaults. And I'll get rid of all the glitches and everything. Then do your software update first before you start doing anything else and it should work for you so i'm gonna go drop this thing off and i'll see you guys on the next video